welcome back to my channel it is july 31st the end of the month so i am cleaning up the house today cleaning it all out every month i do like a total clean down <laughs> trash for real but i'm gonna use what we got left okay i gotta go get some more today and then we got black cherry merlot it smells so good darius doesn't like it he says that it smells like medicine but i like it my mom got this when she was in town from bath and body works it smells so good they discontinued it i think because i was looking for the body wash um but she said august or september they are bringing back a version of this so i'm definitely gonna be on the lookout for that uh, recycling guys this has to go out to the car it's just a little washer because i washed it and then i never took it back out honestly i might just wipe this down on here guys we are on to the living room now this is actually basically me and Darius's room guys we have a two bedroom and I didn't really know if I wanted to share that at first but like I said we're being real with you guys about everything that we're going through in life and bringing you guys along with us on our journey so it's not the ideal situation for six people because me and Darius don't have our own bedroom, but it works out. Our situation beforehand was a lot more chaotic, so we're super grateful for what we were able to have, because like I told you guys, we took the first opportunity. The boys have their own room, like right behind this camera. The boys have their own room, and the girls have their own room, and we use their closets for our storage, and their things and our things all fit really well. Um, when we came down here, we really just brought the necessities, so our home isn't like overcrowded or packed full of things, and then we just have been getting things along the way, so it really works out. It's really not bothersome to us. Like, of course, it'd be nice to have our own room, but we are working towards that goal, and we're actually planning on moving November, December, so hopefully that all works out, but for now, this is what we're working with. This is the storage part. And then this part right here, it slides in like this, it slides down and then under, so it just turns into like a L-shaped couch kind of. So it's really, really convenient, really nice, and it works for us for now. We probably will end up keeping this once we get a bigger house, like if we have like a basement area or a spare room, we'll probably put this in there because it can be a bed or a little cute couch. Um, and also you can take the cushions out and wash the outer cushions. So that's super, super convenient. I'm about to do that now. I hate, hate, hate putting them back on though. I'm not a fan, but it is what it is to get this house clean and fresh. 
And it has such a good feeling once it's done. It's so nice. Got this couch off of Amazon. It was, I think, everything comes apart and probably every two weeks I vacuum the storage compartment and like between the cracks and rings of the couch and it's super easy to clean because it does come apart. Our living room also is really bare and empty because I haven't decided exactly how I want the living room decorated yet because I don't want to do too much like I don't want to get a whole bunch of furniture and things because like I said this is a temporary situation and we are planning to move to a bigger home so I don't need a lot right now. I was thinking of like maybe an area rug, a little TV stand and then a TV and that's really about it guys. I have been like super simple and straight to the point with furniture and belongings in this home. When we have a bigger home, you guys will see my style is very open, spacious, and not cluttered. Like I don't like a lot of things. So that's kind of the vibe right now. Part that slides under just so it stays in place, which is really nice. Which I'm glad I'm taking this off because last time I put it on, I was in a rush because I was irritated and the Velcro isn't like lined up the way it's supposed to, so it's been sliding. So I'm planning on fixing that today. Another good thing, the fact that this like is such a big area and I don't have a bunch of clutter, I can move it wherever I feel while I'm cleaning. So I'm going to move it towards the kitchen. And guys, we usually have the couch against this wall and then we have the little dresser and the TV over here. But I don't know, like I might do it against this wall, but I'm not sure yet. Our living room. This is the girls' room. That's the boys' room. And that is the bathroom right there. And that's the closet that has all my stuff. I will probably move this coat rack more to the corner like it was. I was going to leave it there, but not the couch up there. Guys, I'm super, super OCD and weird about things like that. So, that's probably going to be what I'm doing. I'm definitely moving it more to the corner, though. That's another thing. It has to be touching the walls. I don't know why. It's just what it is. As you can see guys, this is the storage part of the couch and it does get a little bit messy under here. So I clean it out every once in a while. And then I put dryer sheets down here to keep the smell going. 
The house is clean. I cleaned up the coat rack. I couch back over to Marcos. Oh yeah. We washed the cushions. The girls' rooms is clean. They're about to go to bed. Boys' rooms are clean. We're about to go to bed. The bathroom is clean. Don't mind my clothes. I'm about to get a shower. We got it done. Everything's clean. I am about to shower, lay down, and relax. Tomorrow's gonna be more of a chill day. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. It was kind of all over the place, but remember, guys, it is always good to clear out and clean out your home at the end or the beginning of each month. It's such a good feeling, even if it is an all day project, which usually it's not for me, but today just went a little differently. A clean home is a clear mind. So again, I hope you guys like this video. Please like and subscribe.